<sighs> Today it's been going on for far too long. How long have I been working? Wow, 6 p.m.? Well, I guess I can continue tomorrow. Empty halls. <sighs> hmm? Ah. Well, aren't you a hard worker? And what exactly are you doing here so late? I'm the one who asks first, so if you're not answering, then don't talk to me. Whatever. I had some papers to cover. Revisions aren't easy, especially when they're confidential letters for the school. I'm surprised you're not with your friends today. I usually see you like a pack of wolves looking for prey. Don't assume I don't have friends. Unlike you, I cherish those relationships. I'm not someone who adheres to laughing at people who get embarrassed. Yeah, I saw it. The only reason I couldn't stop you was I was occupied with a lot of things. So I had someone else do it for me. Oh, please. If you think you can get away with anything you want, you best think again. Has anyone told you you're in contamination at the school with your behavior? I'm still surprised you managed to survive. Hurtful? I think I'm only stating facts. Your grades were almost in decline if it hadn't been because of me. As if I had a choice. I didn't voluntarily get out of my way and help you with notes and... <sighs> what now? I can't see anything. Don't even think about touching me. Hmm, I think... There's an emergency button here somewhere. Yep, here it is. <sighs> Several times in my life, I thought I might experience this situation. But I never expected to be stuck here with you, of all people. You think I'm having fun? Of course not. My phone doesn't have a signal as well. How about yours? No? Okay. I don't want to talk. Oh, please. I'd rather spend these few minutes in peace than hear a blabber for the next five minutes. This shouldn't take long. Where did that question come from? I'm like this because I'm a diligent person who knows their boundaries. Have fun? Of course I do. Do you think I don't have a personal life? <sighs> Whatever. It's not that. Because whenever I try to talk to you, you always brush it off and tease me for my behavior. You it to me, then I do it to you instantly. You reap what you sow. Try being nice sometime. I'm kind of getting tired of treating you like this as well, you know? <sighs> no, forget I said anything. No, I'm not scared of the dark. Fine. So what if I am? I never liked being alone in the dark. And what are you going to do about it? It's not like some miracle will come at us and light our way and magically open the door. Sorry. I might have taken out my temper on you several times. 
I'm sorry. What do you mean? Ever get tired of what? This? No, not really. It's not like I can climb out of the rabbit hole now. I'm way too deep into this life I have as a representative. Yeah, everything's on the line. I barely take breaks, as you can tell. I was supposed to join my friends for a coffee date after school, but I had something else to finish. I've been so busy lately. I'm just glad they understand, but I sometimes wish they could help me or at least accompany me. Yeah, right. You're here. As if we had a choice to begin with. N no, not really. Hmm? Just the two of us? I mean, as long as nobody sees us, I guess it's alright. Oh, a local coffee shop, you say? I guess it's fine. Do they have Wi-Fi? No. Why not? W well... Of course I have to work. I always feel something wrong whenever I'm not occupied with anything. And how can you guarantee it'll be fun for me if we're only going to get coffee? Much more if it's just us two. Fine. But if I see a glimpse of your friends, I'm leaving immediately. Saturday. I can finish my papers tonight and assignments tomorrow. Hmm? Oh, um, here. Just take a picture of it. Don't call me unless you text first. It creeps me out whenever people don't ask first. Right. Hmm? Looks like it's back up. Impeccable timing, but it's fair nonetheless. <sighs> All right. I know. Yeah, I guess. I'll see you tomorrow. Take care on your way home, and thanks for earlier. <laughs>